Hello, this is Faint Tola for Let's Talk with Benny Souza. For the 2023 coming election, we would like to interview people on who they will be voting for. So sit back, relax, and enjoy the interview. Hi, my name is Bernadette Souza, and you're on to Let's Talk with Benny Souza. My name is Uluafim. Collins. Issa Idris. Blessing Ozike. I'm Mifa Imanuel. Florence. I'm Moses Yokoho. Uluatu. I'm Patience. That's okay. from Cardinal State. Christopher from Benin State. Abideko. That's the banks from Cardinal State. Who would you like to vote for in the 2023 coming election? Wow, the 2020 com 2023 coming election, I would like to vote Mr. Peter Obi. Peter Obi Shawford on top of the list. To be Peter Obi. The right choice for me for now is to As for me, I choose uh, Atiku. I like to vote for Peter Obi. I would actually like to vote for Mr. Peter Obi. Yeah, actually, we all know as Nigeria youth, I like to vote Peter Obi. And everybody, I would like everybody to come to support Peter Obi so that let our country to stand in a good way. Peter Obi is the best. Uh, me personally, I will vote for Peter Obi. Okay, how about you? Yes, sir, sir, Peter Obi. Okay, so what's your reason? That, what's the reason why you want to vote for Peter Obi? Uh, it's because of what he have promised Nigeria, and uh, according to what he has done when he was governor of Anambra State. So I really like uh, what he has done, and uh, the division he has for Nigeria. So I like to vote for him. How about you? What's your reason? Okay, my reason for voting Peter Obi is, um, you know, Atiku and uh, Tinubu, all of them have. Been they have been inside this game for so long. I think we have been contesting since 1993 or so. He has a hiding agenda. Same as Tinubu. So I know they have a hiding agenda, that kind of a thing. But if you hear them talk, you know that these people has all of them, they just want to be president. So that even if they retire now, they say I was the president of Nigeria, that kind of a thing. But Peter Obi has better vision for this country. That's why I want to vote Peter Obi. Why do you want to vote for Tinubu? Because um been looking at that man, could teach anything, and the only thing he's doing, I will the best that he can do. So like that he has no context for any presidential election before. So as it is now, I just think we should just give him a try and try his best. Do you have your PVC? No, I've not. <laughs> So you're not collecting your PVC. Have you ready staff for to collect your PVC? Yeah. So you're going to get your PVC before the election. Sure, sure. Why will you be voting for Peter Obi? Because I'm so interested of him. I know that when I vote him, he will be written us in a good way. He will lead us in a good way. That is why I want to vote him. So that he will lead us in Nigeria for a good way. So that we enjoy him. Do you have your PVC? And will you be voting in Lagos? Yes, I will be voting in Lagos. Oh, you have your PVC? Yes, I have it. Okay, so you'll be voting for uh, Mr. Atiku Abubakar. Yes. So what's the reason, what's the reason for voting for him? Okay, reason why I choose Atiku as my choice to be my the next president of this country, uh, in his uh, statement, he says he's a unifier, as in to uh, unite Nigeria, Nigeria citizens to become one. So I love that, to be, for we to become unite in this country. My reason to vote voting for um, Peter Obi is that when he comes to this election 2023, mm -hmm. he will make us to be proud because the other presidents are not in a good term, as in everything was so costly. But now, I want, if if he came, so that everything, all the things that is costly now, I we want everything to be less than because things are costing the market. Who will you be voting for? Everybody's obedient. Yeah, I'm, I'm to show everybody's obedient, okay. and that's that, that, and that's the thing we want. Okay. You know, uh, I don't want to talk about parties. Okay. I want to talk about intellectuality, and what I mean by I mean Obi being that person we need. Uh, look, like he used to say, he still can't verify. Okay. I think I did a little bit, a little, a little, a little research. Uh, at, uh, about, I'm from Anambra, so I did a little research. 
and I found out so many things about Ruby. You understand? In times of pain, the workers and all of those things. I find out all this. So I, I think when he comes, he's going to do better. He might not do to an extent where we want it, but he's going to change the whole thing. In fact, he's going to be the. In fact, he's going to build the. He's going to be the ladder. I think yeah, he's going to be the ladder. In fact, he's going to start. He's going to be the starter. So when he starts, the others can follow. In fact, we need. In fact, we need him. That's 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 the truth. We need to be. And in fact, everybody is obedient. And I have my PVC, and I'm going for B. Thank you very much, Mr. Party. Money. Just I'm very proud of you. Thank you. God bless you. Do you have your PVC to be blessing? Yes, of course. I have my own. I am going to him also. All right. Thank you very much. You're going to vote for Mr. Peter Obi. Yeah. So what's the reason um, for voting for Mr. Peter Obi? So, so far on the news, like, so far, I believe that he can change, he can, he can make a change towards everything that, that, that has been happening currently in the country. So I believe, I, I so much believe that we will make that change. Okay. Yeah, he's the one I like to vote this 2023 coming elections. Okay. So what's your reason for voting Peter Obi in 2023 coming yeah, elections? My, my reason is that I didn't like old man again because I want a person who take good care of our country, the next coming generation. Okay. Yeah, that is why I like voting Peter Obi. For me, I don't like voting. So I've not voted before. You never voted before. I didn't even have voters cards. Why? Because I don't need it. Oh really? Why? You don't believe in any of our leaders. You don't you don't want someone that you desire to lead our country to be in power. Not that I don't believe in them. But they promised but they didn't fulfill. But you've never voted for anybody. But those that voted, all their promises is, is in vain. We know what Bali was doing before he entered that post. But now he didn't do anything, so that's why I didn't, I didn't believe in any, any of them. So anybody that comes into power, let them do whatever they want to do to us. God should intervene. That's just the thing I know. Why do, why we want to vote for Mr. Peter Obi? Um, because I, I really feel that he's good for the youth and he's full of opportunities. You know, you know, because um, we, we really want to see the future. You understand we are filled of the past and um, unfulfilled promises and so right now it's time for change and you know not the past change we have been having when we say change it's real change this time so that's the so i really advise everybody to vote for um peter obi you understand he's the man we have been waiting for understand? So. thank you miss so do you have your pvc um, yes, 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 I have my PVC. We have heard from the streets of Lagos as regards the forthcoming national elections. We have heard what the street had to say and who they think is their preferred choice of candidate for the presidential election. For some, it's Batify, that is Bola Ahmed Tinubu. For some, it's Articulated, that is Alaji Atiku Abubakar. And for some, it is Peter Obi, whether you're obedient, whether you're articulated, or whether you're Batified. It is important that you understand that voting is your civic responsibility and you have a right to vote in the next election. We have seen the state of Nigeria when it comes to unemployment, when it comes to insecurity rates, the double digit unemployment and also the inflation. I don't know what you're thinking, but if you're thinking in the direction that I'm thinking, we should know that the forthcoming election is very pivotal to the growth of the nation. I want you to understand that you must vote in the next election because it is your right to vote and we can't continue to look at Nigeria and the states. Thank you and have a wonderful evening. <laughs>